for uh, for making this happen, and uh, he had a fantastic stint. So we're just going to hope uh, that everything works out. Oh, see where massive we are in, uh, big crash. I think there's been a big hit, so I'll go back to the booth. This is a big one, guys. I don't know where that oh. car on the straightaway is, but that's a, that hit a ton. Really bad hit. Car on the right, heavily damaged. Car on the left. Wow. Our sixth full course caution. And our second major accident. That is so fast through there. You're... You're just really, really on the throttle hard, and there obviously has been contact. There's two cars involved here. Number 38. Most heavily damaged car. The prototype challenge machine of David Ostella. There's the 52, the other car involved. The 52 car is not terribly hurt. I'm really concerned about the other car. Montecalvo. We'll have to wait to see if there was contact. But boy, oh boy. Let's see if we can have a look at what happened. Frankie Montecalvo's climbed out. And they're oh, climbing that's, out. That's really good to see. Glory oh, be David Ostell of Canada. That wow. is really good to see. Wow. Wow, that's a testimony to that carbon fiber tub and how strong that is. That was a massive hit. One of last year's winning drivers in class. And quite a debris field, as you see. Yeah, this will take some cleaning up. There's a replay. Look. He's a little bit wide. There's a bit of damage to the left rear. That's just wide. way out in the gray, and then Monte Calvi had nowhere to go. Yep. You can't turn from there either. Once you're at that point of the racetrack where you're already on the throttle. Under the tire wall and the secondary impact. Yeah, there's nothing. Even bigger than the first. He's just wide all the way through, Dorsey. He got into the gray. Yeah, he got into the gray, and the car wouldn't turn. It pushed straight out to the wall. Monte Cobble had nothing he could do. He was already on the throttle and had planned his exit. 